everyone. Good morning. Welcome to today's live stream. Now we are live today. We are not normally live on Thursdays, but we decided to do three live streams this week because next week my kids are going to be off for spring break. So I knew it was going to be a little bit harder to do two live streams next week. We're going to be on next Wednesday, but we definitely wanted to make sure that we brought you guys enough live streams this month. So I'm so excited you're here. Now, if you've never watched one of my streams before, my name's Liz. I have a DIY YouTube channel called Liz Fenwick DIY, and I'm here with my content manager, Delaney. She's behind the scenes. She's hanging out with me. She is going to answer your chats. Any comments, questions, concerns you guys have, make sure you leave them for us. And Delaney and I, we are based out of Kansas City, Missouri, if you're not familiar with us. And we're just excited. You know, it's gloomy. It's raining. We're definitely like that March weather today. I kind of, it's, it's like the spitting rain. Yeah. It's really dark today. Yeah. <laughs> Yesterday it was rainy, but there was a little bit of sun today. It looks like it's almost nighttime. I know. Like Delaney has our lights in full force right now. I have these huge windows on either side of me and it's pretty, it looks like it's I don't know, seven o'clock at night. It's yeah, it looks dark. like it's about, I need to go to bed. <laughs> right? <laughs> um, but we're so excited to be here, and we would love to know where you guys are from. We love knowing what state you're from, city. If you're in a different country, we love knowing that too. We would love to know what your weather's like. Usually when we complain about our weather, somebody's like, it's like negative 20 degrees and <laughs> snowing. So That's we so have true. no room to complain. Um, Sashi, thanks for joining us again this morning. Lindsay and Monica are already on. Oh, and if you guys aren't following us, go ahead and hit that follow button here on um, Amazon. And it says, I think this is, is, tell me if your name is Sharon, lives in Overland Park, Kansas. So really close to us. So glad you are here today. And then if you're over on YouTube, you guys, I want to show you how you can get over and find us here on Amazon. So there's an arrow over here. Click that. There's going to be a link in the description box. It's going to take you to where we're live streaming. You can unmute me, click and add any of the products to your cart. Um, do we have anybody saying hi over on YouTube? Yeah, it looks like we have Rose says good morning. Hey, Rose. Beverly. Hi, Beverly. We have Sharon. Hi, Sharon. Annette. Hello, Annette. Glad you're back. Annette's joining us from California. Hi, Annette. And yeah, it looks like everyone's starting to comment where they're from. We have Beverly's joining us from Massachusetts. Hi, Beverly. Did I tell you that we're going to, um, me and my family, we're doing a trip to Boston this summer. So we're really excited about that. I may have told you that in a past live stream. I'm not sure. <laughs> and then we have Rachel joining us from California as well. Rachel's up early. Yes, thanks for yeah, joining yeah. us, guys. And it looks like Mary Lou is joining us. Lindsay says it's rainy in um, Mississippi. And Monica's having really nice, oh, cool here. She says that they're having cool weather right now. Yeah, it's supposed to get pretty cold here over the weekend. So not we were, great. It was so warm for like three days. Yeah. And then it went back to cold. Yep, that's March. I mean, yeah, we could get a snowstorm here any minute. You never know. Okay, you guys, I have a full live stream. I couldn't believe I added the complete, like in the live stream, if you add too many products, it like stops you from adding any more. So I completely filled up the live stream today. So we gotta get started because I have so many cool March favorites to share with you. And some of the items I've never even shown you before. So I'm excited. I tried to pull a few summary products as well. Um, and like always, what I'm wearing is always linked at the end of the live stream if you're interested in anything I have on. Okay, first up, you guys, is my microwave s'more maker. Now, if you don't have one of these, these are so fun. I love doing these with my kids, but they're not just for kids. I mean, Delaney, she loves making s'mores all the time. You know, so anybody can enjoy and love s'mores at their house. Now, this kit, I'm going to show it to you. It's so fun. But my kids love using this to create microwave s'mores. So what you're going to do is in this back section, you're going to fill it up with water, which is going to create steam when you put it in the microwave. And then on these two little um, areas in the front, you're just going to create your s'more like normal, adding whatever ingredients you like to add. I'm very traditional with my s'more ingredients. And then you're going to take these two little hands and place them on top. Then you'll pop it in the microwave for around 30 seconds. You really kind of have to watch it. And when you pull it out, it just creates the perfect s'mores. It holds them in place so the marshmallows don't go everywhere. Um, and then you can just dump out the water and easily rinse it up. 
such a cute little item and if you can't have a campfire or if it's raining outside this is a fun way to have s'mores with your kids so love this this is one of our favorite products i feel like this would make a great um, gift for anyone a great gift for families maybe if you're going to a housewarming party this would be great as well hey nicole i'm so glad you're back today oh she said they have mosquitoes oh that is not fun Lindsay said she's never had a s'more before what? oh my gosh <laughs> Lindsay, you need it that's like our staple uh campfire yeah. stuff yesterday delaney and i were doing a home hacks video that'll be out probably not for a little bit Couple but weeks. we changed out the marshmallows and we put peeps in there and Delaney, Delaney actually ate it. Was yeah. it good? What I was going to say, I was like, I ate a s'more <laughs> yesterday because we did that video. It was good, actually. I feel like it tasted a lot like just a regular marshmallow. Yeah. I couldn't really taste a lot of like the outer sprinkles on it once we microwaved it. But it was so fun to do. Yeah. It was such a cute little idea we had. Fun. Um, I was going to say, I was telling Liz that I don't know. Let me know if you guys have done this like adding Reese's or other candy bars to it instead of just Hershey's. This is a new thing I've discovered. Yeah, yeah, She Delaney was saying we should do like different things. I'm like, whoa, 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 that's a little too much for me. I don't know if I can handle I think Reese's. it's fun to do like the different chocolates, but that's a new thing I've discovered. So let me know if you guys have ever done that before. Yeah. All right, you guys, this next item. Now, You, if you've ever bought, um, you know, outdoor furniture before, you know it's really expensive. And last year, I was trying to uh, get all this different outdoor furniture at the lake. So I was trying to do it affordably, as, as affordable as I could. And some of the items I bought, you know, just weren't so great. But I will say this next item was awesome. I This bench that I got to put right outside the front door was only $42.00. And it was like that perfect bench where honestly, not a lot of people sit there, but you could definitely use it to sit. Well, a lot of times what we do is we kind of throw things on there. Like people are always throwing life jackets on there and different things like that. But this is a metal bench for $42. So great. I put it together myself. It was really easy to put together. Um, and it's just a great bench. If you're needing something affordable and you don't want to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars, this might be a great option if you need this somewhere in your home um let's see uh, sh okay somebody said rick's crackers instead of graham crackers never thought about I that. Try that or kit um, kat bars i haven't tried a kit kat bar yet okay the kit kat bar i could definitely be into because i really? love a kit kat bar i think i could try that maybe we should do that we'll like, try to next candy home hacks s'mores. video we just do a bunch of s'mores <laughs> uh rose <laughs> It looks like Rose says, what? You haven't tried crunchy stuff in your s'mores before? Butterfinger's good. Ooh, that could be good. That would be that would be good. All right. I guess yeah. I guess I'm like the only I'm kind of a boring eater, I feel like. I don't try a lot of cool stuff with <laughs> really? my food. <laughs> I love chocolate. Ashley said that Reese's is the best with s'mores. Yes, that's my favorite. That's is Reese's. Like, you know, Annabelle loves Reese's. So I feel like my really? daughter it's Annabelle. My so I feel like if I got Reese's one time for the s'mores, she would just be so excited. No. That's crazy. I guess we're behind on this trend. Everyone yeah. else is doing it already. Yeah. All right, you guys. So another home decor thing. If you are needing a mirror, I want to tell you guys my mirror that I picked up for my bathroom is on sale today. It It's actually pretty good sale because I remember it was around like $150 last year. They have it priced at $93. So if you're needing an arched mirror for a bathroom, this mirror is also great for an entryway. I think it would look really nice there. Um, just a really multi-purpose mirror. And I feel like the quality of this is awesome. Um, and you really can't beat the price on that. So if you're needing a mirror in your home, that's a good option. Now, another item that I actually installed in this bathroom, this bathroom has a really small shower in it. And so whenever I am, you know, shaving my legs, I always need some kind of footrest and there's no um, bench in there. There's nothing to put your feet on. And if you have a small shower, you know the struggle. So I went online searching for something and I found this product on Amazon that's called the safe, it's called the safer grip shower footrest. And what you do, you don't have to, you know, install it any with any screws or anything like that. All it is is suction and you suction it onto the shower wall, and then there's a little clamp that's underneath that you can press down. 
this has been awesome once i put it on the wall it stayed on there you have to really kind of press it firmly on there to install it but this has been great um, to have in my shower um sashi just said she ordered it last week very nice and very strong grip yes sashi thank you for telling me you had a good um um experience with it i know some of the reviews on it are negative people saying it fell off but the people who did say it worked said they just tried to push it on there as firmly as they can and put the gripper down so honestly this is a great option i was thinking in that shower we really needed to get a bench just because that's what i preferred um but my husband was like well you know the size of it like we can't we have to do this tubs round i was like okay i'll I'll figure out something else for it. So this has been really great. So if you have that issue, this would be a good one. Ooh, uh, 22 degrees and Northern Nevada for MJ. That's not good. All right, guys, next up is a charging cable um, station. Now this is by the brand Hercules and these are typically they have these typically priced around $25, $30. Today, it's priced at $19.83. Now, we have this sitting on my husband's nightstand in our bedroom because if you have kids, just yourself alone, there's so many different devices that we have to charge from phones, you know, iPads, laptops, you know, for work. There's just so much and they just are all, you know, they just collect everywhere. What I love about this system is it's got six different charging ports. So you, it keeps them all very streamlined. So we can have several things charging there. And then there's just one plug into the wall. I also love that when something's charging, it lights up blue. So you know that your device is charging. Because I don't know how many times one of my kids is like, my, my iPad didn't charge. And I was like, well, was it plugged in all the way? <laughs> you know, and so now if they see the blue, they know that it's charging. Um, it also comes in a bunch of different colors. Like I have the silver one here. I believe it comes in blue and black. Are those the colors? it comes into yes you can also get it in different sizes if you guys click that link and scroll yeah. down you'll see all the different options available for this if you need a smaller one mm -hmm. i'm not sure if they have a larger one i know they have a smaller one i know they have one that just has three yes and six i don't think they make one larger than a six um but this is a great charging station you know maybe you want to put it in your kitchen for all of your charging devices we also have one um you know that we put in a basket to kind of charge everything so it's just a great you know with all the devices we have now it's a great way to charge things all right you guys let me know if you remember me showing these around christmas time they are a set of four smart plugs and this was my first time using these and at the time i used them with my christmas tree but you don't have to just use these with christmas trees you can use these with um you know lamps anything you plug in in your house and basically it is a smart outlet. So you're going to turn it on to the side and then it has an app on your phone. So you can literally adjust what you have turned on and off with your phone. You can also schedule it. So maybe you're going to be, you know, away for the week. Maybe you're going on vacation and you want your lights to come on at various times throughout the day. Um, you can schedule it to come on for a few hours and then it'll go right off. So you're not wasting a ton of electricity. It's really easy to use. See how there's just this little power button on the side. And again, everything you plug in, you just plug directly into this outlet. This was so awesome with my, um, using it with my Christmas tree. I set my Christmas tree on a schedule and I didn't have to worry about it. It was so great. Like, um, so I could definitely see this being functional with, you know, your different lamps that you have out. Now these are for indoor use. And the set that I have, you guys, is in a set of four. If you want a smaller set, you can totally do that. Um, I believe they come in packs of one and two. Yes, yes, they do. Yeah, so you can definitely adjust that. So, I'm going to... Oh, yeah, you go. go ahead, I you was going to give a couple shout-outs on YouTube. <laughs> no, Sorry go about ahead, go that. Ahead. That's great. We have Tandy says, good morning from NYC. Hi. It's sunny in the good 30 for you. degrees. Yay, I'm glad you're having some sunny weather this morning. Then we have Cynthia joining us from Florida. Hi, Cynthia. And then let me know your name. We have someone joining us from Boston. Awesome. Hi, guys. Thanks for joining us. Um, now, if you're just now watching us on YouTube, you guys, or I'm sorry, if you're just now watching us on Amazon, make sure to follow us. Delaney and I go live too. This week we went live 
three times a week. We share our best deals here. So you definitely want to be following us um, so you don't miss out. When you follow, you just get this notification that says, hey, they're live. You want to come watch them. Um, and if you're doing something else, don't worry about it. You know, you'll catch us later. Now, we also put all of our live streams on my YouTube channel. So if you're following me on my YouTube channel, Liz Fenwick Daily, and subscribed over there, you'll get notified from YouTube that we are live streaming. And if you're watching me on YouTube, I would love for you to come over here on Amazon. So there's an arrow over here. Click the link in the description box. It's going to take you to where I'm live streaming. You can unmute me. All the products are down below in the carousel. You can easily click on them and add them to your cart. Looks like we also have Victoria joining us from Minnesota. Hey, Victoria and Christine's here. Awesome, guys. Now, if you're going to be doing any sort of traveling this summer, or if you're like me and you constantly lose your keys, this next item you may want to consider picking up. Now, these actually these next two items. This is an Apple AirTag. So what this is great for is it's great for putting on something like I put this on my keys so that um, if and then then you just download the app on your phone. So anytime my keys are separated from me for any reason, I get a notification on my phone that's like, hey, this is where your keys are. And if you need to find them, you can find them. So it's awesome for that. I absolutely love it. I wish I could put one on my cell phone. Like, but then how am I going to find it? Because <laughs> I always am losing my cell that's phone. That's a good point. <laughs> um, <laughs> but <That's> then... <laughs> need that too right <laughs> i wonder if you got see neither do you, you have an apple watch yeah i was gonna say maybe you could use your apple watch that is true yeah i don't know but these are great you guys these apple air tags are little discs you can put them in your luggage too um so that you can always track them i know a lot of people around that time where a lot of luggage was getting lost were really wishing they had these in their luggage so i'm gonna be throwing mm -hmm. this in my luggage if i check it now the thing you need to get with it if you're going to use it as a keychain are these silicone um, cases for your Apple AirTag. And the reason you need these is because they essentially have like a little keychain with them. So you can just put the AirTag in here. Now the one I have, I have like, I think it came with a set of four or is it five Delaney? I can't. It's it a set it. of four. Set of four. And you just put the keychain in here and you can easily put this on your key. The little Apple AirTag goes in this little slot. So these are great to have for your keys or anything that you may lose. Yeah, I guess. Okay, Kristen said the Apple Watch will just ding your phone. That's a good point. And you can use a computer if you yeah. lose your phone to ding it. I was going to say, Liz, I was recently talking to someone and they found a lost cat. And there was an Apple AirTag on their collar. So they were oh. able to find the owner. Or the owner was able to find it through the Apple AirTag. I was like, that's so smart. I want to put that on my pets. I, I don't know. know how I would do like, that. is there a call? I feel like I they're kind of heavy. Uh, put one on our dog. Yeah, on the dog too. Yeah, that's a great. I bet they make collars for them. I bet they have Apple AirTag collars. Yeah, we'll have to look into that. That's pretty to cool. show on a future live. But I, I thought that was such a good idea. And they're not like they're only twenty nine dollars right now. That's yeah. so inexpensive. I feel like an Apple AirTag would really weigh Moose down. He's only six pounds. <laughs> that's true. I don't you think probably could, need a big dog. I don't think he could handle it. <laughs> Yeah, you would have to have a little bit of a bigger tug, but I think your cats can handle it. They're pretty big. <laughs> Let me, I kind of want to, I'll, after the live, yeah. I'm going to like feel how heavy yeah. the air tag yeah. is because <laughs> I'm like, how heavy is that? It's not too heavy. Dim, thanks for following us. You guys, make sure you hit that follow button if you're not already. Now, this next product, I've shown this before, uh, but it's such a cool product and it's great for your purse. Now, this is called the bag net, and I think this is especially great this time of year. It looks like a simple keychain. Um, and you can attach it to the edge of your bag. Now, what the bag net is for, it has a magnet in here in this little blue area that holds up to eight pounds. So if you go out to restaurants and you don't want to put your purse on the floor, maybe you're at a bar with like high bar taps or, or sorry, high bar stools. You can actually set this on the edge of the stool. Maybe you go into a restaurant that, or I'm sorry, a restroom that doesn't have hooks. You can hook this onto the door if it's metal. Um, this is also great for gyms, sporting events. Think about those sporting events you go to and you don't want to put your bag like on the, you know, stadium concrete yeah. rows. Uh, but you could put this on the back of a, um, a stadium chair. I love that you can just leave this. Like you can see how I have this hanging on my bag there. Um, so if you keep it on there, you never know when you'll need it. But this is a great little hack that we love using. 
The other thing that really surprised me about this was how good the magnet works on this. Like when Liz stuck this to her fridge in the video, it was sticking on that oh fridge and that bag was pretty heavy. So heavy. Like I used to keep my bag so much heavier when we filmed this clip than I do now. I couldn't believe that it stayed up there. Like really, really holds in place well. Um, yeah. Lindsay, that's hilarious about your phone. I do that all the time. I, I, I'm, I'm like totally doing that one. Victoria says she loves the bag net. She has one. And Beth, thanks so much for the follow here. Okay, let me show you another gadget that I use in my house. Now, this is in my daughter's uh, closet. We had this problem with my daughter where uh, she would always leave, leave her closet light on. So we would drive out of the driveway and we would notice her lights on. So she would have to like get out, run in the house, turn it off, come back down. And it was this whole thing. So we found this product on Amazon that is essentially a motion sensor light. So we installed it on, um, you know, her outlet switch. And basically what it does is anytime she goes into her closet, closet, the light comes on and then it stays on for five minutes. So it just detects motion. Now I've been in her closet where it literally just stays on. It kind of knows when you're in there. So it's nice. Like when we were cleaning out her closet, her light just stayed on the entire time. It didn't go off. Um, but if you're not in there, if there's no motion, it's going to go off after five seconds. This is just like change the game in her closet. I absolutely love this. So if you have an area where people just consistently leave the lights on, you definitely want to pick this up. We just um, renovated a pantry. You guys are going to see that video. I think it's coming out on Monday. I'm so excited for you guys to see that. Um, but we put a regular outlet in there and Chris and I were just talking. We're like, we need the motion sensor light in it because people just go in there and then the lights on forever. We had a question if the install was easy. Yes. If you know how to install just a basic light switch with wires, um, you should be able to install it just pretty easily. And all of the um, information is in the packet. Looks like we have a lot of people commenting on the bag net. Nicole said, I've been thinking of need... I needed one of these for my bag. I even thought of asking you guys. Yes. And then Victoria, yeah, you're right. Victoria says that not all bathrooms have metal doors. That's yeah. a good point. That's the only bummer with that yeah. one, I would say. Danielle, thanks for the follow. Um, let's see. Glad to know I'm not the only one who does that. <laughs> thanks, Liz. <laughs> yes. Okay. You guys, you're funny. Um, but thank you guys for letting us know your feedback on these products. We really like to know, you know, what works for you and you guys give us the best suggestions too. So we really do appreciate it. Um, next up you guys, now this is like that summertime go-to item. This is called the beverage barricades. This would also be great as a little housewarming gift if you're going to someone's party. Um, but what I love these for are for my pop top drinks. So I love drinking these Celsius drinks. And if you have nails like me, you know sometimes it's hard to open these pop tabs. So you can just slip this on here. And then, um, well, I thought you could. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> this one, slip it on there. And then you can use this little tab to open your drink. But the coolest feature of this is you can swivel it around so that it protects anything from going inside there. If you live in a climate where there's a lot of bugs, I know where we're at in the summer, there's a lot of bugs. This is gonna make sure nothing flies in there when you're at the pool, when you're sitting outside, having a drink. Um, it just makes it a lot easier. Um, also think about being in the car, you know, too. A lot of things fall in here. We also think this would be great for a party because they're all different colors. Mm -hmm. So if you have different guests there, they know which drink is their drink if you guys are all drinking the same thing. So love these. Come in a pack of six. <laughs> yes, Lindsay said no one knows how to turn off any lights. That is for that is for sure. The lights, they, I, I really, you know, they just make less stress for you when you change things out like that, because now I just don't have to constantly be telling Annabelle, turn off your bathroom light, turn off your bathroom light. <laughs> or I guess it's her closet light. Her closet light. Well, her closet's in her bathroom, like connected True. to her bathroom. True. Yeah. I wanted to give a couple shout outs to everyone joining us on YouTube. We have Pam joining us from Michigan. Hey, Pam. Thanks for joining. Then we have Crystal joining us from Georgia. Hey, Crystal. Glad you guys are here. Thanks for joining us. All right, let's talk a few cleaning items. Um, oh, thank you, Lindsay. We appreciate your guys' feedback. You guys are awesome. All right, next up, you guys. Now, have you tried our Swedish dishcloths? These come in a pack of 10. 
and these are awesome not only are they like eco-friendly but they are dishwasher safe you can throw them in the washing machine they're eco-friendly they are really kind of an interesting cloth because when they're dry they're very firm but you can get them wet and they have such a good grip on them so they're great for picking up any spills you have I like throwing mine in the washing machine. I think Delaney is a little crazy. She puts hers in the dishwasher, but she also doesn't have two kids at her house, so she doesn't know how precious dishwasher space is. You know, it's just two people at her house. <laughs> it says you can put it in the dishwasher. I know. It's worked for me so far. I think you can do both. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're just a lot for me. I'm like, I don't have dishwasher space for that. I can't be I can't be doing that. But you can wash them in the dishwasher and they come in a pack of 10. Um, they're just, you know, great. They're eco friendly. They don't have all the chemicals in them. So this is a great option. Now, I wanted to show you another thing that I use in my house, and this is more of an organization system that I like to use. So before I used to have all these rags that we would use in our kitchen for cleaning. And I found that like my husband, if he did the laundry, he would put them in all these like random spots. So I decided, you know, I'm gonna make it easier for him. I'm gonna color code it. And this is for anybody in my house who does laundry. So I bought this pack. They're 50 uh, cleaning cloths. They're microfiber cleaning cloths. I bought them off of Amazon. These are our designated cleaning cloths. They were really affordable. They're only $15.99. And I put them underneath my sink in my um, kitchen. So that way, if they ever go through the wash, they don't get mixed up with other towels. Like, because my husband can't tell the difference between this and like a kitchen towel and maybe like a washcloth, you know? So this, no. I, it really just distinguishes it. <laughs> I, just a couple days ago, my boyfriend grabbed like a bathroom towel yeah. to clean our kitchen counter. And yeah. I was like, that's a bathroom towel. He's like, I don't understand the difference. I was yeah. like, there's a huge difference. Yeah, you got to <laughs> color coordinate it. I'm yeah, telling you, really. since I did this, this has been the best thing I've done. Because these, like, he knows, like, the blue microfiber towels, I put them underneath the kitchen sinks. And also my kids know those are the towels we use to clean things in our kitchen. So this is a great system if you, you know, I don't know, you don't have to use these microfiber towels, but just using that color coding system has really helped us. I need to do this. See, yes. I need to do this. I'm telling you, it's a game changer. Um, a lot of people, I think, are talking about the Swedish Gist Claw, saying how they are amazing and they like those. So thank you guys um, for giving us your recommendations on that one. All right, this next I <laughs> Nicole, that was so funny. Totally. Um, this next item, you guys, this is one of my favorite products. I absolutely love this. If you are somebody who loves an organizing like me, you need this product in your life. This is a new label maker that I got. And what's so cool about it is it connects to an app on your phone. So, but it's not a hard app. It's really easy to do. But what you can do is you can download this app and you can type out what you want to label. And then it connects to your phone via Bluetooth. You can change the size really easily. Um, you can change the font if you want to, but it's, I'm telling you, it's a really easy app to figure out. And then you just print it off and then it's going to print on this machine um, that you put the tape in. I absolutely love this. I've been labeling everything in my house with it. I just, I need another one because, you know, I want one at the office and I also want one at my house. Um, so I absolutely love this. I know that, um, you know, a lot of, I used to use those battery operated like brother label makers and the tape for those were, were so expensive, like almost the price of the label maker. So I feel like this one's really affordable. They have a deal going on it where they're $23.99. So if you need a label maker, I could not recommend this one more. I know that this is going to be in my favorite products for 2023. Like this is one of my tops. I love it. I just... It's just it's my go-to. It's so compact, too. Yeah. I love how compact it is. I really love it. I really love it. All right, another product, Delaney and I were saying before the live stream, we were like, we don't know if we've shown this before. So you guys know I love to organize, and I get a little frustrated underneath my sink because I don't have any shelves. So I found this product, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to install this. This is a pull-out cabinet organizer. 
and you actually have to screw it into the bottom of your cabinet. But it was the underneath of my sink, so I thought, okay, this is gonna work. What I love about it, you guys, is I have, you can see in the back how I have all the drains coming down here. Look at how perfectly this slides into my drain area and out. I can keep, like I have all of my um, dishwashing pods up top. I have the trash bags and my scrubbers down underneath. I can pull it out if I need to. I really don't need to pull it out that much, but I just love the shape of it. I love that it's metal. I feel like it's going to last really well. It's a little bit pricier than some of my clear containers, but I feel like it's, I found that system that's going to work well. And I'm going to be able to keep it in there. I've tried different things as far as like shelves um, that I stack up like metal shelves. But the problem with that is I can't ever get to those items that I need in the back without, I feel like making everything else fall over mm -hmm. this since i can pull it out i can easily get to those scrubbers in the back so if you're needing a cabinet this would be a great option to try out when or, i'm you, sorry an organizer for your cabinet let's give a couple shout outs to everyone joining us on youtube hey we guys. have renee from cincinnati ohio hey renee thanks for joining us have chelsea says hi i'm new to your channel i absolutely love your dollar tree ventures Aww. I'm up early watching you from California, where it looks like we may have rain. It is early. Chelsea, thank you so much for finding me. I am glad you are here and you are part of our community now. So uh, thanks for being here and thanks for watching our Dollar Tree videos. And then, okay, we're getting a ton of comments about the towels. I think everyone's kind of in agreement on this. Yes. Ashley says color coding the towels is amazing. I also got a little hamper for the back of the door in the kitchen and bathroom to put them in so they can be washed and dried. That's a good idea. That's awesome. We have just in our mudroom, we have this little um, container that we throw all the towels in. And so we can just add them to the wash. But love that system. I feel like it's all about the system. It's not really the products. It's just having a system that works in your house is really important. And since there is a lot of you guys joining us on YouTube who are new, let's show you how to get over and watch on Amazon so you can shop all of the products that you're seeing. Yes, guys. So there is an arrow over here. You want to click that arrow and click the link that says shop here in the description box. That's going to take you to our live stream. You can unmute me, watch me over here. All the products are linked down below. You can click on them and add them to your cart. It's just the easiest way to um, get to the products. All right, another item that I think I picked this up at the end of 2022. This is my hair dryer curling iron organizer. Um, I used to put those things in these little bins. You can see those bins on the side, and I still keep some of my items in there. But I was like, let's be honest. I pull out three things underneath my sink. I pull out my hair dryer, my straightener, or my curling iron. So why am I hunting for those things? Let's put those up front so I have access to them. And I'm so glad I did because really this system has been working great. I can easily roll up the cords, put them in, in there, pull them out really easily. So if you're needing an organizer and you have a place where you can sit this, uh, this one's been great. Now I bought it in the black, but it comes in a bunch of different colors too. If you're, you know, wanting a different color option. Yeah, you can get rose gold. You can get gold. You can also get a white and it looks yes. like they have a pink, which I didn't see the pink before. Oh, okay. All right. I feel like I have a lot of organization for you guys today. I have a few. Well, actually, we got a couple more organization products, and then we're going to get into some of my favorite accessories that I've been loving. Um, I kind of have everything today. I told you I filled this live stream up. All right. Another item I've been loving in my closet are these 360-degree, I guess, hangers. Is that what they're called? <laughs> it calls them rotating Ro rotating hangers. hangers well what i use yeah, these for hangers. is for my purses and my belt bags if you need an area to hang purses or anything uh, on it these are great you can just hang them directly in your closet and have access to them this comes in a pack of four you get four for 12.99 i didn't need all four in my closet so i put one in each of my girls closets and then they have purses that they're starting to get so they just added some of their purses on there and it works really great i'm sure you could add other things but i don't not nothing's really coming to my mind if you guys have any suggestions for what we could add there love to hear them mary so glad you got on today we were missing you barbara thanks for following us here on amazon now this next time you guys, this has been one of our best sellers here on Amazon. 
And I think the reason it's a bestseller is because it's affordable. Don't you think? Because yeah. I feel like there's so many options of these. Yeah. But this one sure. is really a good option. Now, what I'm talking about is my bamboo three-in-one organizer. It comes in a three-in-one. It also comes in a two-in-one. If you click on the a link, you can see the different options. Now, what this is for is this is just a fancy way to store your wax paper, your plastic wrap, your parchment paper. You can put it all in there. And I'm telling you, it just looks so nice. You could have this live in your drawer. Um, this, I'm going to show you guys the three in one and how it all works together. It's made of bamboo. It also has these labels that are clear, so you can put the labels on there. If you want to hang this on a wall, you can do that as well. I put mine in the drawer, but it's kind of just that personal preference. Either would work. So you slide off this door on the side, then you're going to take your wax paper, your parchment paper out of the boxes and you just slide them in. Then you can put the door back on, then you can just pull them up through the middle. They have these cutting tools on the side of them so that anytime you need to get a little bit of paper out, you just place it down and then just move the cutter across the edge. It cuts really nicely. Um, so these are great. You know, you don't even have to take it out of your drawer. You can just keep it in your drawer, pull out what you need and slice it across. If you want to take it a step farther and label, you can do that as well. So I put labels on mine. Uh, but this is just a great system. If you don't already have one of these, I cannot recommend it as enough. And if you guys click on that link, you're going to see there's two different sizes options. So the three <laughs> slot that we're showing you is $19 today. Mm -hmm. And then the two slot is only $11. Yeah. Mary said her papers actually tear off better. I agree with you, Mary, because for the, some reason yesterday we were doing a hack video and I was making some cupcakes and I was pulling off foil. And for some reason I was using the one that was still in the box. And it just, yeah, it did not pull off well at all. I feel like this little um, slicer tool just works really well to kind of get everything off. And you can see, I don't even need to take it out of the drawer. All right, and this next item, you guys, now I know from some of you guys who watch me all the time, you've seen this product, but <laughs> I just love it. All right, so this is a product for your laundry soap. If you use these big laundry soap containers, you know that that cup gets super gunky. So what you need to sol solve that problem is to get one of these risers. What's cool about these risers is the cup that you have, you don't even have to put it onto the container anymore. It can just sit on this riser. And anytime you need soap, you just fill it up, take it off, and then put it directly back on that little shelf system. So that cup's never going to get gunky. You're not going to have soap that's falling down. Um, so this has really been a game changer for me. And it's just a basic item. It's like this little plastic shelf. I wish I would have come up with this because <laughs> like how smart. Okay. Uh, so love this. And this has honestly been one of my best sellers on Amazon. So I know other people have this laundry soap problem and it's not just me. Victoria says I've been putting my plastic wrap in the freezer for an easier cut. Very nice hack. I think I watched it on your channel. I don't think we've ever done that before, Victoria. I've never tried that, but that's cool. I just screenshotted your comment, and yeah. I'm going to save it for us to do in a future hack video and try that out. Because that's a cool idea to try out. <laughs> Lindsay just said, I have to fight with plastic cling, cling wrap in the <laughs> box. <laughs> I know. What is the thing? I don't know. Well, my thing with the cling wrap is once you get it out, and then it starts to, like, then it, you mess it up, and it doesn't stay pulled out, and then it starts to yeah, get on other things. It's all over. Oh, my God. It's kind of the worst. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. All right, guys, let's get out of cleaning. Let's go to some fun accessories. So first up is this bag. I feel like this is going to be like that bag that I go to spring and summer when I want to be a little bit dressier. It's giving me like flashback 90s vibes because um, I feel like maybe I had one of these bags at some point in my life but i love it it's so well made it has like that swoop finish on it but if you click on the link there's a bunch of different options available it has a like faux crocodile finish to it um on it you can't really see that that well on the white but it, and then it also has these great gold detail on the hardware and it has a crossbody stripe or strap so maybe if you want to take this on vacation and you were wanting to make sure it's multifunctional, um you have that crossbody option as well comes with 
a ton of different colors, I feel like. How many different colors are we looking at on that purse? All of these bags that we're about to show you guys have a ton of different options. Yeah. I feel like Amazon is really good about giving variety. There's about 20 different colors on this one, and there's a couple prints on it as well. Um, Lindsay wanted to know how much the laundry riser was. That is $17.99. I feel like the price doesn't vary on that. I have not seen it go on sale, and I'm pretty sure it's I can't remember when we bought this. Was it before Christmas? It was before Christmas. Okay. I feel like it's pretty much while. stayed on that one. Thanks, Christine. You guys are so helpful. Um, yeah. So I feel like that price has an adjust. I don't, I mean, it could definitely go on sale, but I don't know if it's going to drop. Mm -hmm. Victoria said maybe it was TikTok. <laughs> yeah. You might have seen it. I feel like I say that all the time. I read something. Oh, yeah. actually, I just watched a TikTok. Yeah, I saw a TikTok. Like, oh, I I think I saw that somewhere, but it was definitely just a TikTok. <laughs> I mean, sometimes we forget. Sometimes we forget even what yeah. we put on our channel because yeah. we have so much content. <laughs> we might have. I don't think we No, did. I don't remember doing that. I don't that. remember it, but. <laughs> it could have. I don't know. Yeah. All right. Next up, you guys. Now, if you do not already own this belt bag, I want you to consider it because I own it in three different colors. This is the Lululemon dupe belt bag. And, um, I have to tell you, I kind of like it better than the Lululemon one. It, first of all, it's over half the price. This one's $16.98. They weren't being priced at $18.98, but I think that they're starting to get competition on Amazon. So I've noticed that they've been doing this $16.98 price point. Um, so great price on it. I love it in the white. I feel like it's going to be kind of that go-to bag I use this summer. Now the white has a silver hardware with it. My blue one, actually my blue one has blue hardware, but I know some of them have gold hardware. So you're gonna have to kind of pay attention. They adjust really well. Just love it. Um, I have two of the Lululemon bags and honestly, I wear these over the Lululemon ones. And these come in so many different colors. There's also yeah. a, um, zipper in the back so you can put your phone these also have a couple patterns on them as well if you guys click on the link for yeah. this this probably has the most colors out of anything we're showing today yeah, it really it's crazy does. all the options on this we had a comment on youtube chelsea says hey guys if you have time can you show us how to get to your amazon store again sure so chelsea there is an arrow right over here you want to click that arrow it's going to drop down the description box in the description box there will be a, a link that says shop here you want to click on the shop here. It's going to take you to directly where I'm live streaming. And then you can unmute me. You can um, click on any of the products and add them to your cart. Uh, so that, if you're on YouTube, is definitely how you get over here. So let me know if that works for you, Chelsea, and if you're able to get over here on Amazon. Reginald, thanks for following us here on Amazon. Make sure, or <laughs> make sure you guys are following us here on Amazon if you're not already. Okay, another purse option. I've been loving the purses lately. Now, this is a little bit dressier of a purse, but I'm telling you, the quality on it is so great. This is a woven pattern purse. Really pretty. I bought it in black, and you can see I wore it in winter, but I'll be able to pull it off in spring and summer. It does come in other colors, but look at the detail. I love the little triangle clasp on it. It has a flap in the front. It's going to be able to fit a ton of different items. Gold detail on it so so pretty you could wear it crossbody you could wear it just you know over your shoulder perfect for a date night put it on with like a cute little dress you know i could wear it to my kids school if they have a concert or honestly i could dress it up and down i could wear it you know with this sweatshirt you know as just an everyday bag as well and it's honestly bigger than you think it is um so great bag Lindsay, which bag did you want? Did you want the, I think she, I think Lindsay was talking about the belt bag. Yeah, I just clicked on the next bag clip on accident. So sorry if you guys saw that. I just clicked on it. We have two more bags to show you guys. Yes. I mean, Lindsay, really, it'll just have like all your essentials in it. So you could put, you know, a wallet in there, your phone, your keys, and, you know, maybe some... <laughs> I don't know. I feel like when my kids were little, I had to carry a lot more. But you know, if you're just like running in real quick, you can keep those things in your car. Um, but yeah, I bet you could even stick a goldfish in there. I mean, I, I don't know. I don't really I don't carry snacks for my kids anymore, but I did for years and years. All right. Another bag, you guys. This is a very trendy style bag right now. It's kind of this puffer style bag. I've seen people use these as their gym bags, as totes. It's also a great small or like a tote style purse that you can use. 
I got it in the white. We don't have a clip of it. We thought we did before, but we need to take another clip of it. So we will get that for you. Um, but if you're looking for a trendy bag, but you don't want to spend a lot of money, this would be a great option. Now, the bag that I pretty much have been wearing for the last two months, I feel like is this belt bag. This is more of like kind of almost like, you know, old school fanny pack style. Um, it's a quilted bag. It's black, great gold hardware. I also have it in the cream color. So you can change up the color depending on your preference. It's adjustable, so you can adjust it however you need it to be. Um, but it's a great crossbody bag, and it's pretty big. The only downside to that bag is it's only got one flap opening in the front, so it doesn't have the back side pocket. I wish it had that. Um, so you do have to put your phone and everything in that front side. Yes, Lindsay, you definitely need the belt bag. It's a go-to. So, so many great options, and I mean, just really affordable too. All of those different bags. All right, some of my must-have jewelry finds and things I've been loving in March. I feel like these knot earrings, I have put these on so many times. I did not think I was going to like these this much. And they are like, when I don't want to wear a hoop, these are my go-tos. Like, I put them on all the time. <clears throat> They're very unique. I feel like I get a lot of compliments on them. They're only $12.98 or $12.95. Now, we have the gold. Are they only in the gold land? I didn't know if they came in the other colors. So on these gold knots, they also come in like a other shape. They okay. have like a chain shape. Really? If you guys click on the link, you'll see that. But they don't have another color on these ones. Okay. Um, great, great earrings. The other earrings that I really am just did not think I would like these because I don't wear silver earrings, but the quality of them are so great. And I have found that silver earrings are like, usually when I wear a sweatshirt or like something I'm wearing today, I feel like jewelry is a little too dressed up for it. But if I put on the silver earrings, I feel like they just give me a little something extra. Like here I'm wearing a sweatshirt or like sometimes if I'm just wearing like a tank top and shorts in the spring, these are amazing. They they have the class backs that just flip down onto them. So the quality of them is really great. These do come in gold, but I'm telling you the silver are gorgeous. They're only about an inch big. So they're like that perfect size earring. You guys need these. Um, I love these. I, I didn't think I would wear these this much. And I feel like they I pull them out to wear maybe two to three times a week. Like Liz said, they come in gold, silver, but they also come in rose gold as well. Yes, yes. I know. The whole carrying that huge bag, like who's got time for that? No one's got time for a huge bag. <laughs> okay. And then a jewelry option that I've been wearing quite a bit has been this stackable bracelet. Now, I always feel like this would be a great gift because you can get the initial on it um, and do whatever initial works best for you. Three of the bracelets are stretchy, so you can just put them on over your wrist. One has a clasp on it, but it's still small enough that I can put it, or big enough, I guess, that I can put it over my wrist. These just stack up really well together. If you have some additional bracelets you want to stack with it, I feel like it would work with so many different options. And you get four bracelets for under that $15 price point. Ashley says that they bought these silver earrings in every size and they love them. They are so lightweight. Ashley, I'm so glad you like those. Now, I didn't realize they came in other sizes, Delaney. Yes, they come in other sizes. I forgot to mention that. So you can get like a smaller or a larger hoop, depending on how big of size you want. Maybe I should get some smaller ones just to try out. Yeah, we could try that. Or yeah. a larger one. I do love <laughs> those. all the sizes. I love them. Love them. Love them. All right, you guys. Um, okay. Love that you have the silver hoops in your cart. That's awesome. You'll like them. All right, let's talk. Let's see. I think I got some home decor, a few kitchen items for you guys. My candle selection. I, this Lulu lit or Lulu lemon, lemon candle. <laughs> <laughs> it is not a Lulu lemon candle. This is called a Lulu candle. I kind of went on a hunt for soy candles um, just because I was trying to find more eco friendly candles. And I came across this one on Amazon. And it was priced at right under $20. Love the packaging on it. I kind of took a chance on a scent. When you buy stuff online, you kind of take a, a chance with the scent. Mm -hmm. But we really like this one. And it does have a really good scent payoff. 
Sometimes I buy candles online and I can't smell anything. This one was great. Now I can't speak to the other scents they have, but this one is the Jasmine, Ode, and Sandalwood. Great scents, long lasting. I burned, you know, used it several times. Really love it. Um, so if you're looking for a good candle option, I like this one. I also like that that one's decorative so I can leave it out in my home and it's going to look nice. It doesn't have, you know, kind of like, you know, like a Christmas label on it. That's not going to work this time of mm -hmm. year. Yeah. Um, let's see. Yay. Hey, Chelsea. Glad you're here. Okay. This next item, this has been one of my best sellers in kitchen for, I would say over a year. If you have a um, stove like I do, this is going to be a great item for you, especially if you have a smaller kitchen like I do. Um, this is a shelf topper that you can put on any stove that looks like this. And the cool thing about it is it has metal that sticks right to your um, stove so you don't have to use any kind of screws, anything like that. And this is just going to create extra room on top of your stove. You guys probably don't even notice that I have this. It honestly looks like it's part of my stove. Mm -hmm. It blends in really well. Yeah. If you know, if you watch some of my YouTube videos, it's on there um, and it just kind of blends in really well. But this is great for any additional items that you may want to put up there. Maybe you want to put spices out there when you're cooking. I just absolutely love this shelf. Um, so it's great if you have a stove like this. Um, I don't, so, you know, I don't, Chelsea, I, or I'm sorry, Christine, I don't have a light switch on the very top of mine. Um, so I don't have that problem. I feel my, I, my light switch is I'm trying to think where it's at. I know it's not on the very top, so that may side. interfere. Yeah, if you have the light switch on the top, this might not work for your stove. Yeah, yeah, mine's not up there. Now, I don't think it is. Now I want to, like, go look. <laughs> Maybe we should go look and see. When we go to, we're going to film after this. You know, we'll check. I'm like, how do I not know where the lights are? I think it's on the front. I think it's front-facing. I think you're right. Yeah, I think it's front-facing. I don't know. Okay. Okay, now this next item I've shown you guys before, but it is on major sale, so I wanted to show it to you. So if your family loves pickles or olives or anything that is kind of in that family, this is a go-to container you need for your fridge. So this is the Hourglass Pickle Jar. So it comes with this rubber stop, and then this item that I'm putting in the middle is an hourglass stopper that you wanna put in the container. Then what you can do is you can transfer all of your pickles into this jar. Now you wanna get a regular size pickle. I bought like a really big jar and I wasn't able to fit them all in there, but just a regular size pickle jar will work well. And then you're going to put the lab or put the lid on the top of the hourglass pickle jar. Now when these live in your fridge, you are going to flip them upside down so that they live in the pickle juice. But then when you go to get them out of your fridge, you can flip it back over and unscrew the lid. And then when you take a pickle out, there's no juice on it. You can just easily remove it. Just so cool. Like just such a cool gadget. I don't know who comes up with these, but they're amazing. Um, it comes in a bunch of different colors too. So if you've seen this before, but it's been at like that $25 price point and you've been wanting it, now's a good time to pick it up because it's $19.99. Christine says when she opens a pickle jar, normally her hands aren't big enough to open them. And they want to know if we think you'll be able to open this. I think you'll be able to because this is not a big jar. Yes. This is a small jar. Yeah, it so is you should a, be able to it's open it. It's smaller. Now, the only problem yeah. you have is if you're married to somebody or you live with somebody who tightens it, who tights. <laughs> Um, cause you really, so sometimes I've been telling my, I'm like, Chris, I'm like, I can't open the pickle jar. You tightened it too tight. Cause I think he thinks, oh, we're flipping yeah, it. Yeah. So we got to really screw it on tight. You don't have to screw it on super tight or anything. Um, but yeah, I've had that happen before. Now, another item that's on sale right now that I know is going to skyrocket. It's probably going to be around $55. I would say come the next month is the Yo Nana. And if you have never experienced this, this is such a cool thing. This is a bestseller on Amazon, but it's a way that you can turn bananas or frozen fruit into almost like a frozen ice cream situation, a frozen yogurt. So you put any frozen fruit in here and then you turn the machine on and then it works it. See where that circular area it is? It just kind of churns it up. And then you use it almost like a juicer to kind of push it down through. 
um, and like I'm putting a banana in there now. I also like to use those frozen fruit packets from Walmart. Those are great as well. Um, I think the bananas taste the best, but sometimes I'll do like a combo banana and the frozen fruit. This is a great treat that we like to do in the summer for my kids. They really like it. It tastes good. I like to do it for myself. I feel like, okay, I'm at least eating something healthy versus eating ice cream. Um, so if you don't have one of these, I cannot recommend them enough. It's kind of, you think it's like gadgety, but it's one of those things that I use quite a bit. Um, let's see. Okay, so Christine says the one I have is big. Yeah, Christine, this one is like normal size. Mine is not big at all. Yeah, it's not big. All right, so the Yo Nana is priced at $38 today, you guys, if you're interested. Another item that I have in my stove is the silicone oven rack guards. Now, these are great to protect your hands. If you are clumsy like me and you constantly burn yourself in the oven, you need to put these on the edge of your oven. They are silicone, so they just act as a barrier between your skin and anything you're putting in there. Um, they can withstand up to 450 degrees, and they just help to protect your hands. If you have kids bringing things in and out of the oven, it's really great for that too because you don't have to worry about your kids burning themselves. So I love these. They also, they come with four. They're adjustable. You can cut them down to fit any oven. So if you're worried about them fitting in your space, they should be okay. Now, one of my, I have a couple of bowl sets that I recommend and love. One that I've been using now for years is this set of mixing bowls. And I feel like this is a great set to give as a housewarming gift. I have it in all the blue colors. They're BPA free, they're dishwasher safe. Some of the features I love about them is that they have handles and pouring spouts. So they're great for baking or like, you know, if you're like whisking up eggs or pancake batter. They have a rubber base on them, so they're great. Like when you're stirring in them, they're gonna stay on where you're placing them. They come in a bunch of different cute colors too. Yeah, yeah, they do. You can get like a gray neutral option. They also have some pinks as well. These are all really cute. If you guys click on that link, you're gonna see all the options on those. Yeah, and um, just a great set for $17. The, the price on these stays very consistent. I, they never go on sale. They never really raise their price too. Um, but these, you know, for 18 bucks, you have a nice housewarming gift for somebody. They're not huge bowls. Like, let me show you the blue one. This bowl is not huge by any means, but this is, you know, enough for me. I can do pancake batter. I can do scrambled eggs in here. And they're just, they nest really nicely together. We have a bunch of comments coming in. Sarah says, I saw the Onana machine yesterday. Thank you. This is awesome. We have Lindsay says need to add to my cart ASAP. <laughs> yes. On the, on the Yo Nana. Yes. Yeah. We have a couple people on YouTube. We have Don from Wyoming. Hey, Don. Brenda from Southern Illinois. Hey, Brenda. And then Gwen from the UK. Hey, guys. Now, we would love for you to come over and watch us here on Amazon. Um, there's an arrow over here if you're on YouTube. Click the arrow and click the link in the description box. It'll take you to where I'm live streaming. You can unmute me, add any product to your cart. We appreciate when you check out and purchase through our links. We get a small commission and it just keeps Delaney and I going here on Amazon. So we do really appreciate you going through our links. Uh, <laughs> Lindsay is finding too many things. She is not going to be happy with me because I keep showing stuff she likes. That's uh, That's funny. All right, now I haven't showed these in a while. Like these, I, we have had these a while, but I have not showed them. Now, if you have, I used to have like the same pair of oven mitts for years and years and years, and I was like, okay, it's time to upgrade. So these are a Gorilla Grip oven mitt, and these work so great. They have such a good silicone to them. They have a really nice lining in them. They also have hooks on them, or not hooks, I guess, little loops that you can put. Like I like to hang my... Um, my oven mitts on a cabinet. I put like a little command hook inside of a cabinet. So they have that on there as well. So they can hang up, but just a great quality oven mitt. They come in a bunch of different colors. If you don't want to get the pink, you can definitely change up the color and they're priced at $17. Yeah. Okay, next up, I think we have a couple of beauty items yeah, for so, us to go through. So this, for you guys. yeah, so uh, I actually bought this curling iron. I was wanting to get, and I curled my hair with it today. I was wanting to get a curling iron that was a little bit smaller. 
this one had great reviews. It's the Babyless Pro, and I wanted to get the one inch size. A lot of times I use the one and a fourth inch size, so this just gives me a little bit tighter of a curl. And I feel like, you guys will have to let me know, I just feel like I kind of like the look a little bit better, having a little bit tighter of a curl. I've noticed in videos where I've used this, I, I tend to like it better, but this curls my hair so nicely. It has a variety of heat settings on it, so you can really just you know, heat it up to whatever setting works well for your hair. So if you're needing a new curling iron, cannot recommend this one enough. You can see how tighter the curl is. And, you know, like this morning, I used a large section, so my hair isn't super curly. You can see here I was using smaller sections, so it made it a lot curlier here. But it just, gosh, it just works so well to curl up the hair. So love that. Ooh, I like these nice these next products a lot these yeah. Monolay products we have coming up yeah so this is how my hair looks with the um this is a little bit like i'm using bigger sections but it curls really well and i feel like it holds the curl honestly until the next day if i need it to so love that for a curling iron now my Hanalei uh face scrub this is one of my newer now, if you guys aren't familiar with Hanalei, it's one of my favorite brands it's based out of hawaii and i just love all their products this has been my recent one that I've been using, their Aloe Vera Cleanser. And it just, it's so refreshing. It's just a great cleanser. I just kind of, it kind of like has that aloe vera smell to it, which I love. Um, I use it as a morning cleanser and it just works really well. Um, it suds up really well and the price point on it is under $20. I have, I think three cleansers I've used from their brand. I also have the powder one that's really great. Honestly, you cannot go wrong with any product you try from them you just can't i just i love all their products especially their face cleansers another hanalei product that i've been using quite a bit has been their matte bronzer now the color of this is very universal i feel like it would work with a lot of skin tones i love that it's matte that it doesn't have any shimmer in it and this is what i use after i put on contour to just really um you know bronze up my face i put it kind of in like that e zone like i'll use it on my cheekbones um i go up a lot higher since you know when you get a little bit older you definitely want your bronzer to come up higher you don't want to put it in that um hollow on your cheekbones i also bring it down onto my neck just to give me a little bit of color especially this time of year where we don't have very much color um and then i also use it on my forehead so i like to just kind of dust it all over my face it's not a harsh bronzer to where you really have to be very precise with it. It just works well with a basic, um, just a basic fluffy brush. So really love that. And you know, you know, with bronzers and stuff, they last forever. Sometimes they're a little bit pricier, but they're going to last a long time. Lindsay says she's going to tell her husband uh, that it's our fault. <laughs> she bought so much stuff. <laughs> we'll take the blame. We'll do it. <laughs> yeah, you can blame us. Don't worry about it. We also have... Like, I don't know where all these Amazon packages came from. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh i want to give a shout out to tina from yeah. kansas city hey tina awesome and then diana says i'm late but hey that's hi. okay it's better late than never diana glad you're here thanks for coming over all right you guys now my lip sleep mask that i have been using i've had this now a while this is a great thing to put on your lips at night right before you go to bed, especially if you kind of have dry lips, it just helps to nourish them. Delaney's used this, I've used it. It's just a great product. I love this product. Yeah. And it lasts so long. Mm -hmm. Like this product lasts you so long. It really does. It's a really big jar. I feel like this would make a great gift. Maybe thinking about Mother's Day. I feel like that's a like a universal beauty product that would work for so many people. Now, our beauty mirror. Now, this is the beauty mirror that I've shown you guys now for a while. This is the beauty mirror if you don't have a, a charging cord or like if you're not going to be doing your makeup by an outlet or you don't want to use up an outlet, this is the makeup mirror for you. Now it's foldable, so it's super compact. You can put batteries in it. It does come with a outlet charger if you want to use that though, if you don't want to put the batteries in it. But it has a touch screen on it, so you can turn on the light. Um, the Front mirror is just a regular mirror. On the side, it has two times and three times the magnification. Just a really great mirror. This is another one of our best sellers because it is super affordable. It's priced at $19.99. It comes in a bunch of different colors, but if you need a makeup mirror, this is a good option to have. 
Uh, let's see. Lindsay says she's always wanted to try the lip mask. Um, so, Lindsay, I will tell you on the lip mask price, the $24 is what they had it priced at on Black Friday. So they had it as like a deal on Black Friday for $24. <laughs> but I'm like, I don't know if it's a deal if it's still the $24. So I yeah. feel like I feel like they kind of go up. A lot of brands will go up with their prices come like uh, September and then they discount everything on Black Friday and then just kind of keep it that way throughout yeah. the summer. Yeah. Deborah says, I'm late too. Hey, from Kentucky. Hey, Deborah. Glad you are here. You guys are never late. Glad you guys came. Um, and then I want to show you guys what I'm wearing today. This is one of my sweatshirts that I've worn for years. It's an oversized sweatshirt. It's the Hawaii sweatshirt. I have it in an extra large. You can see it just goes over a nice pair of leggings. In the clip, I'm wearing it over jean shorts. It's lightweight, so you can wear it really well into the spring and summer. I also have the black one in the Los Angeles. Um, uh, it's black and it says Los Angeles on it. That clip's making me want to uh, crimp my hair with the beach <laughs> really? waver. Because okay, yeah. yeah. I have crimpy hair. That I feel have like to show that I haven't like lives. crimped my hair in so long. All right, do it on Wednesday. I feel like I go through phases of crimping. Uh, but today, I'm super casual, guys. I just have on leggings. I have on my Adidas shoes. You know, when it's when it's like rainy outside, I like to be super casual. But this sweatshirt is one of my go-tos. I love a lightweight sweatshirt, and this one's really lightweight. Now, you could definitely make this more cropped if you wanted to wear it with joggers. Go into, like, your true to size. Don't size up. But this is definitely oversized for me. And the sweatshirt is priced at $31. All right, you guys, so we had a full live stream today. I had so many different products to share with you. Now, if you're on YouTube, make sure you come over to our Amazon. Um, click the link in the description box. We appreciate when you purchase through our links. Delaney and I get a small commission when you go through our links and you add them to your cart and check out, obviously. Um, but we do appreciate you going through our links. We... Um, also appreciate you guys just taking the time out of your day to be here with us. It just means a lot to us. If you're not following us here on Amazon, go ahead and follow us. We go live two to three times a week sharing our best deals. Delaney and I will be back again live streaming on Wednesday. Spoiler alert, we're considering doing two live streams on Wednesday. Yeah, we kind of want to try like a morning and an afternoon one maybe. So we don't know. We'll see. Um, we'll because see. next week my kids have spring break. Yeah. And so I, uh, we're going to be going RV camping towards the end of the week. So um, I'm trying to only work one day next week. So we were thinking about doing two. So. We'll see. Yeah, we'll definitely, <laughs> we'll definitely be on at our 8.30 time slot in the morning, 8.30 Central Standard Time on Wednesday. So hopefully you guys will come back and join us. Um, let's see. Let, we, uh, love to see the crimper in one of your lives. Okay, Nicole, we will definitely add that and show it. If you're looking for it, it is in our beauty um, stuff. It's a Conair waiver. It's really affordable and love it. Uh, let's see. Um, Lindsay loves the shoes. They are my Adidas shoes. Oh, Nicole ordered that cat hair clip. Oh, I'm Yay. so excited. Nicole, thanks for awesome. so much for telling us what you got. I th hope you like that gold choker. You'll have to let us know if you like the gold choker necklace. Lindsay, thanks for coming. Hopefully you don't get, um, you know, have too many issues <laughs> for ordering too many things. <laughs> Chelsea, oh, I see Chelsea. I'm so glad you joined us today, Chelsea. Yeah, so glad that you made it here. It's all right, you guys. We're just glad you guys are here. Um, yeah, we were being kind of silly today. I told Delaney before the live stream, I was like, I'm kind of tired today. <laughs> this is nor Thursday's normally like our computer day where we're not working, but we we had a couple of videos we needed to get filmed today. So we decided to add a live stream to today. And uh, so we're we're probably just being goofy today, but that's okay. So I'm hoping I'm glad you guys are here, and we love that you guys are coming back. You know, week after week, we love seeing um, some of our same community here. So thank you guys, and it just it means the world to us that you guys watch us, and we hope that you guys will come back and join us on Wednesday. So hope everybody has a great weekend, um, whatever it is your plans are, and we will see you next week. Bye.